Right, I'm off to Reservoir Hills for what sounds like a black mamba. That may be a cobra. I'm hoping it's a black mamba. I um, haven't had a mamba in quite some time. Um, it's been a few days after our um, terrible floods. So, but today's been a sunny day. We've got some rain coming this afternoon and for the next few days. Look at the damage. That's just some of what we've been dealing with. Yes. Um, so I think this, well, I've had quite a few calls today already for snakes. Nothing venomous yet. Um, but yeah, they're all moving before this rain and we're all a bit worried about the rain coming because there's been so much damage already. No, we, no one feels like more damage. <coughs> Been a bit nervous coming this way. It's the quickest way though. Oh, no, why is that car reversing? But lots of damage here, but also... Uh, okay. But here, this community have been protesting and stoning cars. I do not feel like that. Seems okay. But yeah, lots of devastation here. Lots of, lots of these shacks were washed away. So a very angry community. Um, very upset. Uh, most of Durban's quite upset at the moment. People have lost family members, homes. It's just been... It's just... I've never seen anything like this. Yeah, lots of damage. You'll see... The Palm Beach River was just... He's going to be damaged if he doesn't look where he's walking. Have a look at that. Look at that. Look at all that rubbish. Madness. The Palmy River came flowing over this bridge. Yo. Ah. Yep, as you can see, quite a lot of damage. So, almost at the house. Um, I hope that snake's still there. It was apparently wrapped around a tree. I don't know what it was doing. Maybe trying to climb up, but we'll see. This one. Definitely went up, eh? Hey? Sounds like a mamba. Oh, there it is, there it is. Oh, it is a mamba. It looks like a pretty chunky one. Uh, hang on, I don't even know. No we... Hang on, we... Oh, there, yeah, yeah. Do you guys wanna... Can I just have someone watching just behind me? Yes, see, I don't know how I'm gonna... This is like a cactus euphorbia thing. Oh, there's a big yeah, I see it. Quite a th it is a thick body. That's definitely a black mamba. Black mamba, eh? Yeah. Quite a good sized one, it looks like. Oh, he's curling up on those seeds there. But the problem is all of this is, is quite spiky and not very stable. I think he's just there because of that wind. It's quite more... It, it's more stable for him there, but it's gonna make it's gonna make life a bit more challenging for me this wind. Okay, keep an eye out there, eh? I don't have a clear
thing nearly pooed on my head. That would have been a disaster. I've got the tail now. Bloody not me. <laughs> No, no, don't wrap around the barbed wire, man. Yeah. Tired. Yes, it was so stressful. Snake's tired. Beautiful snake. Yeah, that was really not an easy catch that difficult one um, especially with that wind I spent Monday night sweeping and bucketing water away from my mother's front door to keep the water up with the rains and ended up not so my arms are, my hands really are just yeah I didn't realize how tired they were until they started cramping there um, so that made things a bit more difficult and every time I got the head end of the snake and um, tried getting it, it would wrap its tail around a branch and uh, it, it, I, I just couldn't get it, it was really difficult. So yeah, just a nightmare as you, as you would have seen. But glad I got it, it's tired, but it's fine, there's no injuries. Um, I won't be releasing it in the next few days, um, it will be released once this cold front passes. So.